What you gonna do when I like catch an attitude? Drop to the knees and show gratitude. Kiss my ring, chick. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Jay Laron here. Hey, listen, we got another video. Um, Corey Holcomb again going in on Dr. Boyce Watkins. Uh, a few days ago, Boyce came out with a response video to Corey. And now Corey's coming back with a response video to Dr. Boyce Watkins, uh, where he goes in again, shows some pictures of Dr. Boyce with his um, wife, Alicia. Also, there's a picture with Boyce, Alicia, and, and um, Willie D. Y'all need to check this out. Hear the commentary of uh, what Corey had to say, man. This is funny. You guys, hope you enjoy it. Please like, share, and subscribe. It's your boy, Jay Laron. Let's get into this video, all right? Fair use, fair use. Y'all want y'all get the bullshit out the way? What? You always have something. What's going on this week? What's happening? Uh oh. Oh, yeah. oh shit. Go hey, no, up. I just gotta, I just gotta finish off one of my probably world's greatest destructing acts mm. on um, Moist, Moist Watkins. <laughs> oh, I no. want to start the show out this week by showing yet another. <laughs> Oh no, wait, I've never, are you? Form of disrespect, finish him. <laughs> this is a wedding day photo, I believe, and it is quite shameful, Mr. Watkins. Your problems That's mount. Terrible. Have you ever seen this picture, D? No, I have not. What about Honest you, Martin? Honest to God. No. This one worse than the last one. Yeah. Uh, yeah. This is the man's wedding day who's the guy who's the fella okay boys is the one looking goofy i can't see it's cut off from and my brother willie d oh there you go oh yeah oh look at is that the face. one she looking like why couldn't it be you <laughs> that's terrible if i'm you sorry this, i don't mean to be if loud you was, if you was a random person and you look at this picture you would think Willie D would be the one married now he's the boy walking it down willie aisle. d looking at it like no bitch, go up there and get married to this man <laughs> Hey, do you see boys walking face? Yeah, looks, super simp face ass. This is ridiculous, dog. He looked like the daddy walking her down the aisle. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So yeah, in case y'all don't know, you know, Dr. Boyce Watkins and Corey Holcomb been going back and forth, man, for a while, right? So not too long ago, Corey made a statement about he wishing that his ex or his baby mama was would, would be deleted, right? You know, because you know he's got some issues with her and stuff like that. So Boyce took it upon himself to go on Willie D's page and write a comment saying that he met Corey, didn't like him. So everything's been going back and forth since then. So right now, this is like the reaction to the reaction to the reaction. You know what I mean? It's like they've been having so many back and forths, man. But yeah, this is Corey Holcomb going in on Boyce Watkins' last reaction to what Corey said and yeah, and so forth. So let's get back into it. Fair use. Yeah, that's what we want to keep saying. But we got two, I got too many body language photos just like this. You giving him the benefit of the doubt. On your wedding day, you gonna be looking at another man like that, D? It could be a hot, quick said that means yes, no. you you get down like she get down. Listen, bro. Listen, bro. I want to talk to Mr. Watkins and let him know that even though you made a mistake and threw a match at a flamethrower with Corey Holcomb, I'm not mad at you. But Somebody has to explain this shit right here. All right? Look at how, boys, you see how Willie, do, Willie D suit fit them? That's how yours supposed to fit on your wedding day. You look off the rack like a motherfucker. <laughs> you and Marcus got the most fucked up suits. Uh, yeah. I will say this, as a man, you do need to have a tailored suit, right? And boys, he's not broke, so I don't know why he would have, he would not have a tailored suit. You know what I mean? And of course, all men know when you're standing up, you button, you button your jacket up, sit down, you unbutton it. I mean, you're taking pictures, you know, you look kind of dignified with your, with your, 
with your, with your jacket, you know, buttoned up. I mean, come on, boys, you should know better than that by now. Even when I was in the army, right? You know, we had our suits tailored. You know, we we had our you know class A suits. You know, they were they were always tailored. So, you know, even back then. So, um, and you know, I I joined the military in '88, got out in '96, and since then, as a man, I know tailored suits, right? And it's just something you got to come out the pocket on sometimes. And you know, and like I said, it ain't like boys can't afford it. You know, so all right, let's get back get back into it. <laughs> if Marcus, it's one of the Fourth of July Marcus have on a suit to fit him just like that. No, you, you got that. Shit, man. You, man. Get a tailor, man. man. Why you oh, got oh, you got a jumpsuit in the fedora on right now, man? What are you talking about? I'm a weirdo. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, you just be prepared for to get scrutinized. But who cares? If you don't care, what you want? back on this p- pity mission, <laughs> I heard this week the brother said about his wife. Okay. Look at this picture of her. Do you know how many Italian men want my wife? <laughs> <laughs> That's when I really wow. felt sorry for him. I was like, maybe he really don't get it. Wow. Why like- would you say? Do you know how many Italian men want my wife? That that that's that how, means he want his wife to get smashed by Italian. That's all just gonna say. He put that's the value. What he, said. he put value in the Italian men. He said Italian and Asian men too. I think that's that's what he look up to. He want them to be like. Come on. <laughs> he wasn't drunk. He, he wasn't... just don't know how to talk. Mr. Watkins, you should stop talking. Every time you talk, you you lose more and more credibility, man. Like, it's a lot of people who perpetrate like they smart. But then when you listen to them talk, you'll be like, oh, this is stupid, man. <laughs> man I ain't even mad at him no more, man. The man need help mentally. He is hurting. Hey, boys, I've been in relationships with women that didn't treat me worth a shit also. But you know what? I'm an OG now. I ain't finna motherfucking be stuck up in no fucked up shit. But you late in life, stepping into this. Look at that. <laughs> oh my God, I, I, I actually feel bad for you. The man said everybody calling him a simp for the wrong reason. And I know he was doing it on purpose. I got a woman that adore me. They got my back. And I would get down on one knee in front of the world for her. If you didn't have gout. <laughs> if, if, yeah, if I didn't have gout, like Marcus said. But I'm saying, like, getting on one knee for a woman that you love don't make you a simp. Right. Getting on one knee for somebody who came back out the streets like Forrest Gump girl did. <laughs> that was... Simpish. Yeah, that's crazy. We talk about Forrest Gump, but yeah, he's right though. I mean, <laughs> you can't be, you can't do a lot for a woman that's that, that's not treating you right. You know what I mean? That's like if you got a lady and you, you know, you're doing all this stuff for giving her money, helping out with this, and you know, just basically just putting her up on a pedestal, and she's dogging you out. She's, you know, combative, disrespectful. You know what I mean? And she's just treating you like 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 crap. You know, why would you? Why would you be, you know, overly submissive to a woman? You know what I mean? Because you can be. A man can be overly submissive. And that's all simping is. You're doing everything for this woman, but she's not doing nothing for you. And she's giving you a hard time, dogging you out and stuff like that, right? Not respecting you, basically. It's about what you did. This is this is the problem. Miss Watkins, we need you to come out publicly and say you love your husband because he has lost too much credibility with these photos. I ain't even showed all the shit people sent to me. These photos are too compromising. Miss Miss Watkins, will you please let the world know that you love your husband so I can stop messing with him? Cause it looked like you making a fool out of him. Yeah, man, you, that's the only way he gonna recover, man. Get you, married ain't nothing no more. That's, that's nothing. That's the only way you're gonna recover, man. And you gotta get your wife to come on the internet and express her love for you so we can see how much of a good good of an actor she is. Get out of it, boys. Get out of it. I heard you admit on air 
Yeah, we talked about what Corey said. That's right, you talked about what I said. You think I'm just a comedian? That's a great picture man. right there, though. Oh. I am. I, what does it say? It had descriptions. Who did that? Oh my Look, gosh! What did it say? Yeah, I think this is like this is this is an older picture that was floating around the internet. But this is crazy because this talks about you know don't be this guy, be like this guy. You know what I'm saying? And you got big smile, relaxed smile, arm on shoulder, <laughs> arm on smaller back, open frame, closed frame. Feminine stance, masculine, ma masculine stance, space, no space, no shoes, and shoes. So this this bitch, whoever broke this down was, yeah, they did a good job though. I mean, they noticed a lot of things, and I, I've always said, you know, a picture a picture is worth a thousand words. You know, so just take a look at that picture and make of it what you make of it. But you know, a picture a picture is worth a thousand words. That's all I gotta say. But uh, let's keep it moving. Hey. Oh no! Look how she look how she closer to. Mm, mm, mm. Wait, is Willie D? On? I didn't notice. Bro, wait, wait, wait. wait. Is Willie D waist. arm on the bottom of her it's back? Her waist. Hey, dog. No. I see his fingers. No, no. <laughs> Why is she close to the wheel? She, <laughs> she's like she's been pushing her mom. <laughs> oh, that's a cold game right there. Yeah, I didn't see that. <laughs> oh, I told. You. Boys, I'm praying for you, black man. I'm not here to destroy you. You destroying yourself Ooh, still mentioning me. Wait, they, they, wait. They ain't lied about nothing. I can't see it you with this say camera. No shoes. Yeah, what does that say at the bottom? This, yes. this country nigga out here, <laughs> motherfucker, without no shoes, yo. Oh, oh man. Oh, my God, dog. Your oh, shoes hurt, didn't it? It definitely was at the end of the night then. You probably didn't oh, let Willie Bars get his gal. Mm, they mm, say mm. feminine stance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it don't have they here. say big smile, relax smile. <laughs> <laughs> Who made this? They were, they were too. They're some Look, they got like space between them. Space. No space between her and Willie D. Yeah, he's like he's twirling his toes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mister Watkins, please leave me alone. Don't <laughs> stop explaining yourself, bro. You hurting your brand. You are destroying your brand. Going up against me. You are losing credibility, bro. Tell your wife to hug and kiss you in front of all us on the internet. Yeah, boss, boss does a lot by hurting himself by talking. <laughs> you know what I mean? Cause he's he, he's proving everybody right when he when he talks about certain things. Cause you know everybody know that you know when 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 a one like I said his wife Alicia was already married. She has a child. He comes in, marries her. Um, in certain statements, he made it seem like. You know, she was his last choice, basically. You know what I mean? Because a woman her age with a child, she don't get a lot of people looking for. She, she her options are, are few. You know what I mean? So for somebody like Boyce to come in and wife her up, that's like she was on. You know, she don't she don't she didn't have that many prospects. So of course she gonna jump at the fact to marry him. You know what I'm saying? But he don't see it that way. He see it as somebody he had a crush on. You know, years ago they got back together. They rekindled everything. And you know what I'm saying, and she just married him, you know, because of that. But no, I mean, be, to be you know, if you look at it out on the outside looking in, you can see that she obviously married him because of his statue. You know what I mean? He, he you know, he he's got money, he's got he got some clout. She has a child. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, she don't have him in the prospect. So yeah. Man, do it, do it. Miss Watkins, will you please hug and kiss your husband while he talking and stop looking at him like, I wish he hurry up and be through. <laughs> she look like she rushed you with everything. It's bad, And they've man. been together how she... long, though? Haven't they been together, like, uh... Y'all two come on my show and let me counsel y'all about y'all relationship. Oh, oh, wow. <laughs> Fuck the little arguments we have. And I, I, when it first started, I had a little attitude, which now I'm worried about you, though. <laughs> it's too late. They didn't got married. It don't matter. You could get out of it, boys. I know you ain't got shit for real. Just <laughs> let it go. <laughs> yeah, man. Now, you don't even understand. I ain't don't even, look good enough, I'm not bringing up all he said about me. I just oh, look I at all this shit know. that's on the internet, and I'll be like, wow, is he serious? He telling people to clean up their kitchen, and they, his kitchen is a mess. I can't believe Wait, he what? posted these pictures, dog. 
I don't know. I know he hate this picture out there. That oh is. Do you? Are, are you looking at this woman? How she looking at Willie? Man, she looked at chick. I, I can see her eyes. She mesmerized. That is. A, you told Willie to put that D on her. You <laughs> talk so much shit about black men, Mister. Uh, Mark is stupid. Mark said she want Willie to put that D on her. <laughs> Uh, like uh, what's his name? Uh, Scarface said, "Let go somewhere and exchange sex faces." You know, <laughs> Watkins and your girl is in love with a ghetto boy. <laughs> oh my God, I feel bad for you. I think he gonna kill himself. Though. Oh, oh no, I am so worried about Mister Watkins. Don't stupid. do it. He's stupid. Don't do it. I know I'm bringing out pain that you're gonna try to be like. I could just see him talking to his wife. Well, well, let me tell you what he said. I know you said you don't want to hear it, but let me just say what he said. <laughs> he tried to explain. Right. <laughs> My mind playing tricks on me. Hey, man. Mm-mm. Hey, Miss. Hey, hey, Mr. Watkins. You know, she had a family without you. And then once it was safe, well, she knew you wasn't sw- shooting swimmers no more. She was like, fuck it, I'll get with oh, this motherfucker. Hey, kids. use a retirement plan. Boy, he ain't got no kid. Oh, so oh, oh, what? He like you, Mark. Oh, he ain't like me. He ain't nothing like me. All right, but yeah, that's about the end of it right there. But yeah, so all in all, man, <laughs> you can't go up against Corey. <laughs> you know, boys just need to, to, to shut it down a little bit, you know. Um, but yeah, so, uh, you know, a lot of things Corey pointed out, you know, a lot of people can easily just take a look at those pictures and see the same thing. You know, her, the way she was looking at Willie D, you know what I mean? She, her eyes said it all. You know what I mean? Her eyes, you know, like I said, a picture's worth a thousand words. And her eyes said it when she was looking at Willie D. You know, and then the fact when they when they were, you know, taking that other picture, her body language, her, she was more, you know, she's like, she felt more comfortable around with Willie D. You know, he had the masculine stance. Everything about Willie D is, is masculine, you know what I'm saying? In that picture versus boys, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Willie D's tall. And you know that she likes tall men cause her ex-husband is tall. Her son is tall. So, you know, I hate to, you know, it's like, like that old saying, you know, alpha fucks, beta bucks. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So the fact that Willie D has that tall stature and she likes that she's drawn to taller men. And I think she, she's even said that before. So naturally, you know what I'm saying? She's gonna be more drawn to Willie D versus boys, you know, and she just, it is what it is, all right? But y'all, let me know what y'all think about the video, man. Like, leave some comments down below. You know, it's your boy, Jay Laron. Uh, like I said, you know, I don't, <laughs> you know, I don't know a lot of things, man, but you know, I, there's some things I do know, you know what I'm saying? And I do know that in this picture, <laughs> looks like she was being, you know, more towards, leaning more towards Willie D than she was towards boys, right? Okay, but anyway, like I said, just your mailman, average day mailman out here delivering mail in this hot sun in Texas. Y'all, please be good to yourself. By all means, let's be good to one another. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.